Hey folks, welcome to today's vlog. And uh, today I'm going to start out by doing a couple of things, chores, I guess you could say. Uh, I'm going to start out by washing the bike uh, rack carrier that I've got on the back of my vehicle right now because it's been on the trailer all weekend. I mean, all uh, winter, and it's uh, got some mold and stuff on it. So I'm going to try to clean it up, get it looking a little better, and uh, put some fresh stickers on it. So. Uh, that's what I'm going to start out with today. Stickers. Let's see what, what we can find to put on the bike rack. I've been needing to go through these anyway. Sorry for the shadow. At least it's better than rain. That'd be a good one to put on there if I had a spot for it. Oh, that might come off and that might fit on there. Let's see.
Alright. Boy, it's making a mess getting those off, old ones off. But I think that's going to work. that I think I want to try to put on there so uh, let's see what spots I've got available and I'll set this up and try this again
Next project. There's the mother load right there.
doing some vlogs on the ATV with a pole set up on the back of the new storage box I've got. So that's what I'm thinking. And um, I'm hoping that that will uh, make for some interesting points of view. Except I need a tether for it.
Mount Heaven. Awesome, baby. just then but I heard it beep so I look and see what happened I might have said the wrong word but anyway uh, I think I've got enough ram mounts right now what do you think <laughs> So I wanted to do an inventory on that, on these ram mounts, and see exactly what all I had, and see if I was going to need anything else, but I think I've got it covered, like, to the extreme, so maybe it'll work out. We'll see. I'm going to go grab some Ziplocs, I'll be right back.
think I got what I need. Might need that tether. But that would be it. But anyway, on to the next project. sort of thing so just wanted to uh, pop in and uh, show a little video it's a beautiful day today beautiful day I hate to even leave the house but uh, I've got a few things that I've got to do so I'll check back in a few minutes going through the busy little city of Helleyville <laughs> This is packed. Reluctantly crouched at the starting line. Next event. Engines pumping and thumping in time. The green light flashes, the flags go up. Churning and burning, they yearn for the cup. They deftly maneuver and muscle for rank. Few burning fast on an empty tank. Reckless and wild, they pour through the turns. Their prowess is potent and secretly stern. As they speed through the finish, the flags go down. The fans get up and they get out of town. The arena is empty, except for one man still driving and striving as fast as he can. The sun has gone down and the moon has come up. And long ago, somebody left with the cup. But he's driving and striving and hugging the turns and thinking of someone for whom he still burns. He's going the distance. He's going for speed She's all alone All alone, all alone in a time of need Because he's racing and racing and plotting the course He's fighting and fighting and riding on his horse He's going the distance Assail him, impale him with monster truck force In his mind he's still driving, still making the grade She's hoping in time that her memories will fade Cause he's racing and pacing and plotting the course He's fighting and fighting and riding on his horse The sun has gone down and the moon has come up And long ago somebody left with the cup But he's striving and driving and hugging the turns And thinking of someone for whom he still burns Cause he's going the distance He's going for speed She's all alone All alone, all alone in a time of need Because he's racing and pacing and plotting the course He's fighting and fighting and riding on his horse He's racing and pacing and plotting the course He's fighting and fighting and riding on his horse He's going the distance He's going for speed He's going 
Hey folks, I'm back. I wanted to uh, do a quick little video here of uh, you know how peaceful it is in the evening when the sun is going down. It's, uh, it's really nice out here. Just uh, you, know, you can't really ask for much more. It's uh, just really peaceful. I got it all. This whole area right here, basically to myself. Now that it's mowed, it's nice and uh, easy accessible. I think I'm going to get the RC cars out and maybe drive around this area a little bit tomorrow. Do some checking this area out. You know, I mean, it's, uh, it's really peaceful and really pretty now that they've got it mowed down good. I might come over here and clean up a little bit. And, Give me a little trailing area going here. That'd be pretty cool. So we'll see. I'll uh, I'll check back in a little bit and I'll give you another update before I close this video out. But just wanted to uh, check in before it got totally dark. So uh, I'll come back in a few minutes. Hey folks. been a good day. I uh, got a lot done. Got to go to the store. Um, got some gas. Got uh, went by and uh, got to visit some folks. And um, so I uh, wanted to show what I got. Uh, I got my refrigerator pretty, pretty fully stocked. I got some chocolate milk today. And um, got uh, a few other things. So I'm, I'm good to go. to uh, check in and uh, wrap this video up. I'm uh, just uh, closing down for the day and uh, watching a little uh, dirty motorcycle by the barn. And I um, wanted to uh, thank you for watching this video. If you've watched it this far, I appreciate it. And please check back for another video. And uh, thanks again. This is Rural Overlanding Studio. And I'm out.